This is brought to you by Century High Tech and Samba Federation of Leningrad's region. Greetings to all fans of Mixed Martial Arts and the Wrestling Club Project. We are on the air again and today we will tell you about our heroes. He will soon have a new fight in a new weight category. Alexander Grebnev showed a very good fight. I have one opponent there that I would like to challenge. The biggest test awaited our new athletes in the finals. Wrestling Club. Not so long ago, we told you about Mamur Khamdamov's debut in ACA. He will have a new fight soon, but it will be in a new weight category. If previously he fought at 169 pounds, then this will be the first time that he fights at 154 pounds. He also got a very serious opponent. The most important thing is he got in shape and recovered well. And so we will do everything for a good combination of circumstances in this fight. We are also waiting for news with another athlete, Alexander Grebnev. He will soon have a fight at Fight Night's organization with an athlete who has five victories in a row. He is the GFC champion. Alexander also have five victories in a row. So I think this will be an interesting fight. By the way, Alexander fought at our tournament which the wrestling club organized together with the Sambo Federation of Leading Grass region. And he showed a very good fight. How do you rate your performance after a considerable absence? Actually, I'm not very happy because I wanted to somehow make everything a little brighter in terms of striking technique. The, you know, there were moments when it was possible to finish the fight ahead of schedule beautifully and more spectacularly. But your opponent was not weak that you could just do it brightly and beautifully. I wanted a knockout. I won twice already by knockout, so I thought it would just continue. Putting down people is interesting, well not that interesting, but it somehow keeps you going. The advantage here is I have never fought this hard in my entire career, precisely with control. There were no takedowns as such. You know, someone always tried to fight me, they tried to switch me. But no matter how much I try to get into the fight, they probably have the same game plan. So I think I'm going to have to try some other moves. Moreover, I think to stay at 169 pounds, because 154 pounds is hard, I do not recover at all. I have one opponent whom I would like to challenge. Actually, I think it will be a very cool fight. Uncover the secret, who is it? I won't reveal it until I win. Then I will speak into the microphone, it will be very interesting. But he seems to be more popular in the media and he has already fought at a higher level several times and we are similar in style but he also fight mediocre and in standing position he is not bad actually there is a lot of news in the wrestling club we will tell you all about it everyone has his own unique stories let's begin with one of them one of them is our new athlete nikita severov he recently made his debut and it was his first professional fight and it was a very powerful fight.
с правой проходит два удара от Никиты. Упал, упал Георгий, добивание от Никиты и все, Рэфи останавливает бой. Поздравляем Никиту с севера, из севера, из Москвы. This guy has an interesting story. His wife is very supportive. So how do you rate your first debut fight? You know, the energy and so on. Thank God everything went well. And I won. The opponent was very worthy. Had a very strong spirit and was so uncompromising. I had mixed feelings inside. On one hand, after the victory, I felt such a rush of adrenaline, so joy and courage. Yes. But on the other hand, I tried to restrain these feelings in myself in order to simply to continue to go towards my goal. Not to consider this victory as something great for myself, but as a small step to climb higher. It was a very interesting fight where he showed the maximum of his capabilities. The most importantly is his character, in which the spark of the champion is manifested. He went to the end in this fight and his opponent was very serious. In addition, Nikita performed excellently in the St. Petersburg Comeback Sambo Championship. Come on, come on, come on, five seconds. During the day, he had to carry out four combat sambo fights. Each of these fights was also a manifestation of his personal character. The first step is done. To snatch victory at any cost, I think this is said about him, because he conducts every fight this way. And even during the combat sambo tournament, he made it clear because for every victory he fought, he fought to the last. And now during the semifinals, 30 seconds left, he snatched the last point he needed to win. Yeah, sweet, two points. By the way, Gassan Musakaev is a very, very strong opponent in the MMA. He moves well. Mamor fought with him in a very tense fight. Well, that's it, you're in the final. Nikita is in the final. In the final, it's good. Damn, three fights before the final. The championship in St. Petersburg is, is fascinating. But in the finals, he was in for a biggest test. After the semifinals, he was only given a few minutes to recover. Rather, I would say there were no, no time to recover at all. If his opponent was waiting for the finals, then after the semifinals, Nikita immediately had the finals and immediately accepted this fight. This too was another test for him. The fact that he was able to accept this challenge against the fact that he is tired already is cool. In the finals, he also snatched victory in the last seconds. Six seconds, you just need to do something, and that's it. Do the series, then drop it. Time is short. Yeah, great. But in addition to this draw, which became victorious, he cut his forehead with his own blows. He threw in head knocks and cut himself. Just two minutes. You can't spend more than two minutes at the doctor's. The doctor was already going to withdraw the fight. But he just persuaded the doctor. He persuaded him to give him another chance, just to release him, to give him another chance. 19 seconds left, I understand I'm losing this final one. The doctor wanted to withdraw the match. Yeah, yeah, the doctor wanted to withdraw the fight, but he understand, 19 seconds, he understand I should be given as a chance to achieve something, although I'm losing. Even with the bandit on the head, with his own injury, he continued to beat with his head. He cut his own wound for a victory. Two 
throw, throw him. Here Nikita gave it all. He even sacrificed his health for the sake and desire to win. As a result of the tournament, Nikita Saverov became the champion of St. Petersburg in comeback sambo and will now participate in the Russian championship as a part of a national team. Also added to the team, Oleg Dodonov. Oleg is also a master of sport in comeback sambo and an experienced fighter in MMA. Both our athletes perform in such a way that they perform simultaneously in two carpets since they were in different weight categories. So we had to get a cornerman for two carpets at once. So I think this athlete deserve more attention because the character speaks for itself. What people love in this sport, what we generally love in the combat sport is character, the unbending will. It's just that it manifests itself in these athletes and I think it will be interesting to watch them grow because now movement will continue and it will be interesting to watch. There are a lot of interesting athletes in our team and it will be interesting to watch. And we will show you about the backstage of MMA and in general different martial arts. We have different high league tournaments, the fight night, the ACA and also other tournaments that we also do. I think we will show you different stories from which it is possible to learn something. Including inspiration, willpower, unbending character. But sometimes there may be some mistakes which we will also show you. Subscribe to our channel, Russian Wrestling Club. This project will be released there. Wrestling Club. Make sure you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification.